Don't worry, I'll just get the whim I'll just get Whimslot strat. I'll just get the Whimslot strats this time. Exactly. It's no, easy. No, it's... it's easy. Just don't get hit. It's, ju it's just not hard. It just don't get hit. It's, it's literally just that simple. Like I gotta move. It's not moving. Okay, there we go. There. Oh, I don't know. That part wouldn't have to. Care check. Base care check. Same. Simply a difference of skill. Hi, <laughs> Xander. Hi, Xander. Hi, Xander. I'm running the best category. Delta Traveler Hard Mode Obliteration. Yes, yes. See, the, be the best part about, about this compared to Jenna is that you actually get to see Snowden. Well, I mean, you're still te technically you're t you're still trapped in a. Ru you see, the best part about this is that compared to Jenna, you're still trapped in ruins. However, uh, there's no RNG. Uh, you don't get assaulted by Molt Small. Instead, you just get hit by random attacks and have to waste four minutes healing. You don't get assaulted by Molt Small. Instead, it's a single system that does that. I would run like an actual like any percent like obliteration like normal obliteration not hard mode but uh I tried that earlier and I got it uh and I got all the way up to Paula before I died. Damn. Take the e boy with it, with it, the nice ass rated. Yes, how did you know? Anyway, pretty fucked up thing here. You only want to get two hands. Any more and you'll die and waste time. It's It's ac it's ac getting only two hands is literally accurate to my time if you think about it because they say hands twice. True. <laughs> anyway, this was only a uh, one hand tutorial, but you know it's better I than my. Still better than my. No, they said it three times. I'm dumb. Oh, hey, you have it too. Yeah, I was the first one who had it. I was the one who had it. I, I added the command to my chat first, and then I uh, added it to Ashes later. Also, thank you for the follow, guys. Is that a motherfucking Omori reference? Hey, yo, the pizza here! da 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 Let's go. I got eight Chromer, yes. Yes, redeem your eight Chromers. Stimulate the Chromer economy. Okay, I'll stimulate it again. Oh, I'm about to just reset this one. Okay, I'll do the Wim's Lost Trap for the last two since I'm actually. That's... I'll, I'll see where I am <laughs> later on, but I think I'm just gonna reset the run. Okay, this is not the attack you want for getting 50 TP. I'm just gonna play for the blue tail. How did I dodge that? I somehow squeezed myself through that hitbox. This first split is a little hard for me to beat because uh, I got a. Uh, I did like almost all, all, almost the entire first half without healing. Anyways, chat. Look at this. The funny strat. Look at that. Wow. Time savium. All I had to do with grades. I just had to not get hit. That's literally this run in a nutshell. Just don't get hit. Exactly. Yeah. Getting hit is literally time loss. 
Because the more you get category. hit, the more you have to go back to heal. This category is just... Well, it's just skillish percent. This, cat percent. this category is just, uh... It's just a, a no-hitter's paradise. Or nightmare, I don't know. <laughs> it's time for me to lose my mind for the next 30 minutes. Woo! Woo! Let's go. I love Bradley Tail! Why are you running Bradley Tail? I want record. I'm literally second right now. Yo, I got exactly 50 TP. Nice. Really, hold on, I'll screen share my suffering. Oh boy. Quirky, Earthbound inspired RPG. Sounds like Earthbound to me. If you're Earthbound? God, this game is just a blatant Earthbound rip. I mean, there's even a part where you just are literally playing Earthbound. Damn, how old is Under? <laughs> Keep forgetting that you're probably attacking Whims a lot first, but you know. Yeah. I can't believe the Earthbound rip just ripped off the, the Trevor Section 2 like that. I know! Jeez! It's crazy. How dare they? Oh, I should have gone for the crit. Damn. I'm stupid, I forgot how much damage I do. So it's reset tutorial, let's go. It's like Persona 5 fans will either get to play it for the first time on Switch. <laughs> so true. I love it when Persona fans. Are they getting to play their favorite game for the first time? So yeah, it's only at like, I think this is Love 4, I think, that um that a fight rude would kill a frog in one hit. Is, is that like one hand? Great tutorial. What was that, bro? That was one hand. What the hell? Not even, not even three. Just all one hand. Oh my god! I targeted f my brain. God, there isn't cursor memory for what who you're targeting. Oh yeah, I hate that. <laughs> It, it messes with me so much. Just to make sure the defend, defend, um, and then five three buster for, for himself. That's only like that's only at love two, isn't it? I think if you're at love one, you need to crit. I need to hey. heal. I tried him when I was at level one, and I got a crit, and it did not. Yeah, okay. I mean, how much how much damage does Frisk with a crit at, do at level one? Uh, let's see. Never mind. It crit, Susie killed first. Yeah. Let me uh, see. Because I, I, I think uh, I, th I think a rude buster does around seventy. So actually, yeah, the math checks out. It is possible. It is possible at uh, love two though. Forty-nine damage from Buster. What? Did you mash? Okay, I stopped. What? Did you mash? Wait, that. Wait, what? <laughs> Did you mash the Rude Buster? No. Is yeah. A thing? Yeah, that's a thing. Yeah, that's a thing. Okay, well I didn't know that. <laughs> that's that's good. Ah, hell nah, he froggin. True, froggin. Gif. Or it's like a little, this? yeah. Like you just have to press Z or Enter one time at any point during the casting animation. Okay. I just, I just learned. Something. I just mash because you know.
mashing is fun, yeah. Just mashing a rude and a rude buster or a red buster just is really satisfying. Sorry, I'm bringing my reset for you. <laughs> I love breaking my reset. Yeah. So true, <laughs> Jimmy. One second PV pace. Yo, what what are you running? Bradley tail. Oh. Uh. I hate Moldessa, it has so much HP that a rude fight still is, is barely not even you enough to kill it. Like it's... Off Ash. Yeah. See, good Asgore RNG. Oh, wait, no, never mind, I'm not on the PV pace anymore. Not Dang. Mistaken, I think, not mistaken, I think four crits in two turn, well, one Moldessa, but if I remember correctly. I'm gonna get to a certain love. Yeah. Okay, good run. Let's turn up Hatch back. Hi everyone, hi Rowan! Hi Rowan! Hello! Also oh, yeah, uh, getting uh, uh, all crits for two turns is enough yeah. to two turn it. So I love how much Rude Buster's damage scales. Like, you know, lo like the love before this was doing like 80, and now it's doing like 100. Okay, okay, well, that's a death run. Stop giving me three hands. Jeez. Rude Buster yes. scales stupid hard with stats. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Thank you to tell it for if it's, if it's accurate. I would assume so, but I don't know. Shit. Frish. I'm frish. What a funny character. Frish. Frish Undertale. Oh boy, back to hell with Toriel. Alright. Let me out. Just let me out. Let me out of the Toriel RNG. I want to get to the Papyrus RNG. RNG is when you get RNG. Literally the entire run is RNG. Alright, just doing that for the split, and then I'm gonna go buy. Let's go buy a lot. I have a lot of time to save on this split. Just from how the amount of times I went back to heal. Oh yeah. That, that, that's why I had such a big time save. I'm safe by um, 20, 20 Literally if I don't if I if I don't need to heal at all during the final grind, then I save a minute. Because I had to on the very last encounter I had to go all the way back to heal because I had like two health. Yeah. Honestly at, at that point sometimes just sometimes just risk it. <laughs> if I'm at that point. Just grab my ribbon. I still think the I I, I feel like the ribbon is worth it just because the less damage. Yeah, Parsnik. Uh, if you get both crits on on two turns, uh, then you can uh, then you uh, then you can do it in two turns. That's not that's good to know. And, but unlike astigmatism, uh, if you if you miss one crit, then you still can't get oh it. Oh my god! Because I know astigmatism it's is actually... like uh, you can miss one crit, I think, and still get it. 
I always fucking brew Buster Toriel. <laughs> nice. <laughs> like, I think if I hit both crits next turn, I'll still be able to get it. Oh no, I, I could. Well, it might, that might be love dependent. Thinking about it. Oh my god, it's this fuck. I, it's this attack specifically that I hate. Cause like how 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 how? See your screen. What is it? Run? This attack. How are you supposed to dodge that? Good question, honestly. You don't. Wait, who, who are you fighting? No, it is not. It takes way too long. So we're about moving left and right. Yeah, that makes sense. It's just... Ah, uh, the, the project... Like, the, the trajectory, I think, just fucks me up. Especially when, like, they're, they all start like that. Okay, yeah, this is a good attack. This, this attack you graze a lot on. Okay, I. You, you did say it, you did say it wasn't guaranteed to get it at level one, right? Mm -hmm. One slot. Yeah, I think. Okay. Yeah, okay. Because because we're not just sitting on one. Just, just making sure. Mm -hmm. I think. All right. Did I forget a astigmatism? Whatever, I, I might need to go back to heal anyway, so I'll get it then. I just realized I only needed two of the... the, the fuckers. Whatever, I'll eventually need to go back to heal so I can literally grab it then! I'll fu- yeah, like, you know, right now. Like that. I meant to defend- Okay, that's why I need to mistake with left, is it vegetoid? Honestly, I'm not sure. I was just going off of, like, half of what I saw from a normal obliteration run. I, I don't even know. Oh my god. Oh my god. I, just, I just lost, like, a few seconds because Do not I was die. not paying attention. The final frog it just jumped far into the corner away from me. That's a chase it. Okay, good. I, I'm glad I forgot it. I'm glad I needed to go back to heal. Oh my god. Optimal, uh, optimal Space bad strategies. They said he should run this. Space Space this. Space this. Normal no. obliteration is hell, yeah. This, the I big room and the cave, ugh. I didn't optimal time loss? Obliteration. It's very long. I don't even want to try normal obliteration at this point. I mean, I made it all. I, I I wasn't recording the run, obviously, but I made it all the way up to Paula before I uh, before I threw in the towel. Before I threw in the towel for the run. I keep forgetting about the high eh. choicer. It's actually like a decent run. The cave, like, sucks just because, like, there's a lot there. Also, some of the attacks in the cave are really bullshit to dodge. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Like, the bats. The bats plus moles is terrible. I hate it. Oh, yeah, the bat. Oh, my God. Skip sandwich routing. Uh, I think, from what I remember from what I've watched from Magic and what I did, uh, you buy the skip sandwich. Like, you go through the entire big room the first time, kill everything once, buy skip sandwich... Uh, buy two skip sandwiches and then use those to go through the room all the way back to the cave and then all the way back to sands. I just got a uh, fought root. I, I didn't notice I had 50 TP. I think my favorite is uh, the bear enemy. That one's fun. Because uh, if, you, if you get the B like attack, you just sit there. You oh, just sit yeah. there and let it get you to uh, max TP. That's a fun one. I think it's like a little slower to do that. I think like you can end the attack earlier if you grab the jar. But uh, that risks damage and I... And also, yeah, uh, the skip. there is a skip sandwich in this cave. I forgot about that. Yeah. Okay. Actually... I'm 
me. I, okay. I should have healed before fighting the double final frog, but you know what? I don't care. Yeah. yeah, it's it's for the entire room. So. So I remember when I was messing around, I had to leave the room right near the end. Because of, uh, I was just that low on health. And I was trying to save items for, uh, for Paula. Well. Okay, remember to fucking fight Root this time. Remember that you have TP. First guy actually dying, there was optimal. <laughs> that was actually so sir. Yeah, uh, the fan game speed running. Oh yeah, this was the encounter where, on the very last one, I had to run all the way back. I'm trying to just go go back to heal less and less, but sometimes it just <laughs> ends up screwing me over more than anything else. Oh, pain. So I guess, what did I do then? that one time, because I thought I killed it. Maybe it might not have been at full health. Maybe I got, like, a tap by Frisk right before that. I think maybe that part, the, when I did that in practice, that part stick probably had been tapped by Frisk. That, that would make sense, because that did nowhere near killing. Oreo, please, dude. Please. I just want out. What did you eat for dinner? I had hibachi. We got- we ordered Japanese. <clears throat> Luigi fight AO Undertoad? I just can't wait for, uh, Section 3 Obliteration where you have to hit so many quads to save turns. Oh my god. That's gonna be pain. I'm not looking forward to that. At all. We only have one pan at least, true. One pan for now, but we, as we all know, the very first shop is gonna sell pans. Alright, and then I split. Look at that, two minutes of time save. I like I was holding left like I was expecting the normal choicer here. Clipping through Toriel's ass. That's my favorite glitch. Not even a glitch, it's just funny. I think I noticed it, like, in call when I was messing around with hard mode, and I just said, I love clipping through Toriel's ass. Yeah, that was oh a Wolfel D out of context moment. Yeah. Anyways, now we go back to get the real no. no. <laughs> I it's, it, op it's, op it's optimal, trust me. I feel like the only way possible way that could be worth it if, is if hard mode continued past section one. Yeah. Even then, even then it would depend because. Well, I mean, like you get you have such higher damage rolls. Like it's fi it's yeah, fifteen but... attack. Yeah. Every other weapon that you would get between now and uh, like even just up to section two, I think like the highest weapon there attack there is eight. With uh, oh, yeah, the crack sure. bat. Sure. Hell, I think the I think Chris's knife slash the real knife has more attack than the pan because the pan was like thirteen. I don't know, I have to check my casual save. So. Flower. Flowery. Boy, do I love flower. I still can't get over, uh, when I was casually playing hard mode, and I, on the way back to grab Chris's knife, I was just like, imagine if it was the real knife. Anyway, shout out to this fight literally, like, being so much more free on, uh, oh, ha on oh, yeah. hard mode of Blit. It's like, what, five, seven, five, uh, six turns? So. Doing, like, hard mode Flowey on, like, any percent hard mode is sucks. I, you, all you have is, like, the pie. Yeah. And, like, maybe the bandage if you decide, if you decide to grab, uh, ribbon like I do sometimes. Even though I'm trying not to do that.
Oh, I love this attack. I genuinely love this attack. It's so satisfying to graze. Genuinely, that's probably my favorite attack in Flowey Hard Mode. Genuinely. Oh, Papyrus, let me out. Please, let me out. Oops. Yes! Okay, 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 okay. Let's go. Uh, okay, uh, this is record pace. Seems like Dick and Balls don't die to Paula, idiot. Yeah. 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 Uh, also, just uh, being able to survive the onslaught of enemies in Section 2 is See a hard that, part. Not screw me over. All right, I lost, lost a bit of time there. Probably from that extra turn I took. I think I probably took an extra turn here. Oh no, Asgore screwed me over. Yep, that's okay, it. Okay, this is time loss for sure. Dying to Paula. Oh, that was so close, dude. I love that Ribbon. So I love close. six seconds of time loss. <clears throat> yeah. The only reason this I pick up Ribbon loss. here is just because, like, the less damage could actually, like, save me a trip to a save point. Yeah. 26 second time save somehow? Let's go. And look at my two minute time save on second half. But yeah, I, I think the hardest part of, uh... Section 2 Obliteration is just getting through everything at the beginning. Because you have to go through the entire first room. And then you have to go back through it. And then you have to go again. And, and the only closest save point is at the beginning of the of the section. Yeah. So if you want to go back to save, you can only do it after your second trip through the room. Which is why, I, which is why when I was practicing, I bought hamburgers. Oh my god. I love... Yeah, dude. Also, shout out to this effect. This effect right here is the coolest effect in the game. Oh yeah, that 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 effect is sick. Yo, what up, Gaster, my home my homeboy, home slice bread slice. Funny jump pal, shout out to No Blade Knight. Yep. I can't believe it got fun. Does Blade Knight present exist? Uh, aces. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that would have been faster. Hard was. mode, all bosses win. <laughs> oh, you know what? That is true. I never even thought of that. I could technically add that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> my stalling at the my stalling at the door in Lost Core lost me two seconds. But uh, hey, look, new world record. Twenty-seven fifty-eight. No. Yo, GG, let's go. GG. Gaming. Literally, literally just, literally just had to not get hit. Skill success. That's literally what this was. All right. Skill solution found. I'm gonna whip up the middle thing. I might try learning this. Yo, let's Yo. go. Delta Traveler runs are pretty fun. Shout out to the, uh, what? How many wrong- two wrong warps and any percent, is it? Because yeah, there's- there's Wooful Warp, the one wrong, wrong warp I contributed, and then wrong warping out of the, uh, shed to skip, uh, the cultist right encounter, back. which is the funniest one. Cultist skip is so funny just because it's only there because, uh, the default point of, uh, the large room has- has to be updated for the checkpoint to work. Yeah. <laughs> And it's set when you enter the shed. Alright. We should start wrong warping out of car. Oh yeah! That that would also work. I, I never even considered that. 